Hey, what's up guys? George here from TechStuff31. Today I'm going to be showing you how to display content from your iOS device to your TV that has a Chromecast set up with it. Today I'm going to be showing you how to display content from YouTube, but you can check the link in the description to see a list of ever-growing apps that are available to be used with Chromecast. We're going to go over, open up YouTube, and TechStuff31, this is our YouTube channel. Let's just look at a video. We'll scroll down to find a video we're interested in watching. You might want to watch what is TechStuff31. So I'm just going to click on that, and we're going to stop it. You can do this anytime. There's a, this button right here. It's, it seems almost like the uh, Wi-Fi symbol, but you can see it's kind of curved, and there's a box. We're just going to click on that, and this will show you um, a list of Chromecast devices that are on your local network. And this is the only one we have, so we're just going to click on that one. And you'll see it sets up, and on the TV, it starts to display the YouTube application as it's already open. And it's seeing that I have already opened a video, it will display all the information about it. And we can watch the video on the TV. And so let's say, for example, you want to pause the video. You can just use your device and hit the pause button on there, and it will pause. You can skip ahead in the video, and it will do an update with that. So this is very versatile. It's essentially a control for um, YouTube, and you can display any content that you would like. There are many, many applications, and even more still in the future, that are being developed to be able to be used with Chromecast. So it is a very useful device to have. It's only $35, so I would say if you have the money, go out and buy one. It's very helpful um, when you're just not in the mood to watch a video maybe on your small um, iPhone, iPad, and even. You can just display it right onto your um, TV. And this works with many more devices than just iOS devices. So it's much more versatile than an Apple TV although it does share some of the same features.